Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be checking out Garbanzo Quest. This is the demo that I found on Steam. Uh, well, no, sorry. I found it on itch.io originally. You can buy this on itch.io. I believe this game started in itch.io. Regardless, there's a, de a, st uh, a demo, the, the demo that they want you to play because there's like eight or like nine demos that you can download uh, on the itch page. So I, I went to the Steam page. It was like, this is the demo they want us to play. As you can see, the guy is not white and it has a green hat on so like i have a save file on this i played a little bit of the demo from itch.io and i'm like you know what i'm, I'm gonna go ahead and <clears throat> just do a different game uh i'm gonna send you away a little start oh right we're gonna do our name let's do let's call ourselves let's call ourselves batty All right, Batty goes hard. All right, pleasure to meet you, Batty. I'm gonna have to pick. Uh, I'm gonna have you pick a character now. Oh, right. Cause, so we get to pick from between Garbanzo, Pinto, uh, Frankie, which is like the developer's dog, I guess, and Ghostly. Uh, this is only for player two. He can fly around, uh, but that's about it. Okay, so I was gonna say, hey, let's pick Frankie this time. But I think I'm going to go with Garbanzo, because my original playthrough, I played with Pinto, and I'm just going to do Garbanzo this time. Uh, the tweaks menu. I don't know what the tweaks menu is, so I'm going to still say nah for this video. We're going to play it We're gonna play it straight as is, right? Demo as it is. But yeah, this game is really cute. The, uh, the writing and the text is very Undertale-ish, where it's like cute and adorable. It's a fun, friendly world. And uh, we're going to have to skip this just because of the video. I'm sorry, developer. I apologize. Um, but yeah, we're going to play as Garbanzo. They're going to show us how to jump around and move, which is nice, which is good, which is good. There's a vibration. I just realized there's vibration on here. Can I turn that off? I don't know where that would be, so never mind. All right, cool. Let's jump. But yeah, you can jump. You can jump, shoot, climb, break walls, uh, shoot down. Look at this face. <laughs> Look at this face. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love it. Garbanzo was so cute. Like, the style, the style that is these characters is very adorable. I like it a lot. Also, the jumping around and platforming in this game is, also feels not, not easy, but just, like, easy to, um, oh, you can also strafe with, with R2. If you hold R2 in, you can face the left direction, you can face, like, right and just, like, hold and then, like, stay looking right. That way you can like fight enemies or like un like underwater. It's very useful because there are some watery levels here. What was I just saying? Uh, the style is very fun. It reminds me of, like older games that I guess I grew up with. Kind of. I never was really into platformers when I was a kid. I am now because as an adult, I'm like, oh, they're pretty easy to like. You know, they're pretty easy to play. Uh, you run through and it's always like a there's always like a bunch of things you got to collect. And then there's a character that you're playing as. You're gonna unlock abilities. Get a double jump and stuff. Okay. Spit on the bullets, would you? Oh, that's right. It's right. You can shoot projectiles. I think purple ones you can shoot for sure. It's the... It's the orange ones you can't... These guys, you can't. Oh, yeah, no. They, they're protected, see? That's what the shiny bit is for. They're protected. So we're just gonna go this way. Okay, dodge them. Hold the spit button to shoot faster. Let's go. See, they got these sections too, where like you gotta build your path, which I like a lot. I like this a lot. This is very good. Reminds me of Oroscope. You guys haven't heard of Oroscope yet. It's a. Uh, somebody said it was like a Mario. It was it was like a Mario game, or it's just like Mario 64 or something, but 2D. And I'm like, then it's not Mario 64. Oh, but it's got the same movement as Mario 64. Because, like, the character can jump, he can slide on his belly, and then does, like, a little flip. But then he has, like, a backflip and has, like, a double jump. Or, like, if you jump one, two, three, you get even higher or stuff like that. Um, And it's got, like, a lot. It's got the movements is really good in that game. I like it a lot. I don't see why we have to hate on it. It's really good. It's actually really good. Maybe I'll check that game out, too. It's been a while since I played that game. Did we, did we already do that one? I don't think that we did. Like for the, for this series, for the HIO series, I don't think that we did it yet. We I, I did, I have played it in the past, but I don't think that I did it for the HIO series. We should go back and do that game. I should really go look at my Let's Go, my Let's Go series. My, 
my Let's Check It Out series, because a lot of those were itch.io games that are still itch.io games. So there's a very good chance that we could, like, we could, like, get some good games out of that, too. God damn it, you freaks! I will destroy you! Oh. I thought you were somebody else. Please, excuse me. I'm kind of having a bad day. Mmm, how are you? Oh, sorry, who are you? I don't know. Uh-oh, uh, you don't know who you are. I suppose I get, like, that sometimes, too. Uh, I've never seen you around here, though. Are you Are you captured by the Abracadaver? TM, by the way, as well. In any case... It's nice to meet you. Someone with some someone with some sense. The name's Bruce. My paranoid friend built on, built in underground bunker south of here. I often made fun of him for it. I have I have to make fun of him for that. Ugh. But it's gonna be so knowing about it. Uh, anyways, you're more than welcome to go there. Hope to see you around, pal. I need to figure out how to find my friends. Oh! It tells us how many. How many spits we did, how many jumps we did, how many hits we got. What are disgusts? What are disgusts? Yeah, no KOs. Okay, that's fine. I don't think you can kill anything in this game. Oh, maybe our KOs. Maybe, like, our deaths. We'll go check out the bunker in a minute. Let's go check out the bunker when we find a present. When we find a present. How much time we got? We got we got time for one more level. Let's do this level. And then we'll call it a video. I definitely want to play through the full Garbanzo game. In case you guys don't know, I stream over on Twitch and here on YouTube, but more likely on Twitch. Like, I do the Restreamio thing, so I stream on both at the same time, so you can't miss it if you're here. But also, if you're on Twitch, uh, I have, like, a bot there and everything, so you can, like, do things in chat and that, that affect the stream. Because YouTube, I'm not high enough on YouTube yet for me to be able to do that with, like, a bot or something, or I don't know how to set it up very much. So I gotta learn how to do that. But... With that being said, uh, I'm only saying this because, uh, yeah, uh, Saturday, the Saturday just passed. This is going up on, uh, this is going up on Monday. Uh, the Saturday just passed, I played through Penny's Big Breakaway and beat that game live. And a lot of people were there. It was fun. It was great. I had my friends there with me. It was awesome. It was a little, some of it was a little being a little, I was a little angry, not gonna lie, a little angry. The game made me a little angry. There was, a, there was like, you know, a lot of times where I was like, bro, I wish the game wasn't broken right now, but I, but, I, but they've updated it. It's been updated since I last played it, like in the past couple of days. So it's gotta be, it's gotta be fine now, I'm sure. I'm sure it's gonna be fine now. Let me pop that, oop, get up. Ah, I got hit. I'm trying to get in here. Okay, so remember when I said I was bad at platforming? No, how do I get back? No, the rocks have to reset. I did it wrong. I think there's something up there. Look it. Maybe if we go over and then come back. Like if I do this. Yeah. All right. That's fun. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Let me do this. Let's do this the correct way. So do that. There we go. Huh? Bup, 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 bup. And then we go. Huh? Yep. Yep. Got him. There we go. I really like Garbanzo. Garbanzo and Pinto are like the perfect beings. I like them a lot. Oh, it's a key. You're pink, so yeah, you're gonna try to fight me. Okay, gotcha. You fly? A flying key. He said, thanks. Oh, thanks, man. I want it to be free. Thanks, man. <laughs> yeah, it's good. It's good. I, I hit everything except for the path that I wanted. That's great. Alright. I don't want to fall on that bullet. I was going to. This game also, like, the simplicity of this game also reminds me of... Is it Skull Mania? I think it's Skull Mania. You play as a little skeleton and you have no abilities and as you run through, you start getting, like, a slide, a headbutt, uh, a dash, and everything like that, and you mix them up to, like do like maximum maximum movage in that game and it's a really fun game i think i think my fastest i beat it is 20 minutes it's insane how quickly that game can be can be not completed but beat it beaten i'm looking for any more uppies let me go down there we go yeah oh i forgot i can i can blow up the no oh we're good Oh wait, there's nothing. I thought there, was I thought there was spikes along with the bullets down there. Oh, it's the digging guy. I am an in. I am an insectivore. 
I'm an insectivore! I assume is what he meant. I'm an insectivore. That means that if you were a worm, I will freaking end you! Okay, that's fine. I suppose. Oh, we get the yarn! Okay, let me show this bit and then we'll end the video. Because we also get this hat guy too. Ugh, gross! Come back and talk to me about customizations. All right, let's go check out. <laughs> I'm at the box is like, yo, peace. <laughs> All right, let's go back to the home. I want to play more of this game. The key then opens up this building over the secret path. Oh, I, I've never pushed the home button before. That's funny. All right. There's Bruce. He's planting, he's planting his spruce trees. All right. So there's two rooms here. <coughs> One of them is for other abilities that unlock when you get the th there's a, a chest or a gift. There's a gift or a chest, and it gives you a bean, like up in the top left. It gives you a golden bean and a workout guy. The workout guy lets you learn abilities and stuff like that. But here in the customization spot, we can talk to this dude, and he's like, "Oh, well, go pick something out. Use the yarn." So we can pick here. <clears throat> This guy up here makes, I already know from my other demo that this make, from playing the other demo, this makes like a picture, a painting that you can completely customize like right here. It's like a pixel art thing, so you can only draw in stuff. And then this is a blue hat, so I'm wondering that, what these guys are. No, no, do it. Oh, I, you know what? I didn't know you couldn't fall through platforms. That's funny. <clears throat> oh, it's a sick cowboy hat. <clears throat> nice. Okay, and then if you don't want to wear it, you can just do this. Which breaks it off, right? But we can do this, wear it. This is also a two-player game, too, by the way. In case you didn't know, this is also a two-player game. Uh, and I love that it's a two-player game, because two people just going around spitting pew, 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 is hilarious. Uh, but yeah, you can come here, too, as well. The guy's not here right now, but you need beans for it. You need beans for it. Uh, I forget what this orb does, but this guy here is like a falling, like it, you'll jump and then you go, Whoa! and you're invincible and you'll land on your stomach. It's very, very, very similar to Hell Divers. Uh, it's very, very similar to Hell Divers where they, where they fall down and they're invincible for a minute and then they can go pew, 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 pew and shoot and then they can get back up again. Obviously, like you can, you can scooch around too when you're on your tummy. It's very funny. I believe this one gives you a flutter jump and they, the description, I didn't use it, but the description is very similar to like, it's how Yoshi's works. Like Yoshi goes up and he goes, mm -hmm. it's like that. So it's, it, I think, I think that's how it works. And it's like exercise equipment you can mess with. But yeah, guys, this has been Garbanzo's Quest. I'm excited to actually play this game. I might do this this Saturday, play Garbanzo's Quest this Saturday or Sunday, one of the two, um, because I want to make my Saturdays and Sundays like uh, th that's the reason why I mentioned that actually earlier. Uh, Saturdays and Sundays are going to be like full gameplay days. So I wake up on Saturday morning, I wake up, take care of the dog, eat breakfast, do my workout, and then start playing a game. I'm going to play a game all the way through. Pe I have a ton of games very similar to Penny's Big Breakaway where there's like a beginning and an end, and it's just a bunch of levels that I have to platform through, right? So I want to start beating those games and then showing the Let's Plays here on the channel. I would like to do that. Or like making super shorts is I think what they're called, where like I'll just take the whole thing and like choo 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 and like scrunch it down to like a 20 minute or like an hour video or something because it was like seven hours of footage so like if i can break it down to like an hour and put the whole game in an hour video and people watch it that'd be super dope but yeah i'll work on those regardless if you guys did enjoy the links will be in the description down below for the steam page and the itch.io page if you want to support it on the itch.io page or you want to support it on the steam page garbon's quests will be down there uh and i'll leave the links for the the twitters of the developers in case you want to follow for updates and things like that but i think the game is out out i don't know how long it's been out for because i don't have the numbers in front of me but i think it's out, out. go check the itch.io page go check the steam page and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye